All right, welcome back to Jump One Half for what will probably be the last time. Good, I do start back here. I was a little bit worried that I wouldn't. Also, I'm going to be fighting this boss with bombs, which seems like it's not going to be an easy thing. <laughs> Beatitude for gains. Get good, get good, get good. Next room created by World Peace. As if it would have been anyone else. He's roasting chicken. <laughs> it's a very Kirby-ish boss. Awesome player was with us, in conflict with us. Battlesuit Marcel, keep your dignity. Oh boy. Okay, so when he does that, he goes back to the other side of the screen. Okay, I've actually done a surprising amount of damage for my first attempt. Okay, this attack, I can't really do anything to him while he's doing this. Well, I took down almost half his HP. Oh, wait. Oh, I can't reset th this boss fight. I, I thought L and R would reset this like the other one. Okay, so it looks like the trick is we just wait for him to cross the screen again, and when he's done that, we drop a bomb on us. I mean, we, we detonate the bomb. So I think we always want the bombs to be on the left or right. Ugh, I gotta stop falling for that. Whoops. This is probably his most dangerous attack. Now if he'd stop using it, that would be nice. <laughs> I also can't hit him while he's doing this. Whoops. I missed the rosary. Yeah, he, he even does that fire thing if I get too close. I wish whoever was opening the garage door and closing it over and over again would just stop. Wow, not sure how I didn't take damage there. That was a miracle. Oh wow, what is this? He has definitely changed attack patterns. But I- oh wow, did I just blow myself up? Because that's pretty great. Okay, he might have only just done one super move. Which is probably better for me overall. Dang it. <laughs> okay, not sure exactly how to deal with this one yet. <laughs> oh, wait. Where did those guys come from? <laughs> okay, so after that he seems to do that jumpy move fairly consistently. Oh, I detonated it on myself, that's pretty great. Dang it.
Wow, he just keeps getting faster, I think. Because right at the end here, he's going really quick. A lot quicker than I remember going at the start. He's just attacking after attack. Oh, wow. How did I manage to do that? That was really dumb. <laughs> So it looks like he does a like a last minute rampage thing. That's what I was messing up. That's what I uh, didn't catch on until uh, pretty much just now. I'm not sure how to dodge his attacks in that phase though, because it looks like I don't keep pace with him very well. I mean, obviously I have enough HP. If I have enough HP, I can just tank it, but. chance to kill me because I killed myself too quickly. Gotcha. <laughs> Man, I love bosses like that, where it's about learning their pattern, that sort of thing, and also it's not over. Oh boy. Oh wait, this is Marcel. <laughs> oh man, I thought there was a second boss fight. The second boss fight was throw an ice block against a wall, and that turned out to be the end. So this brings us to who knows what. But I, before going to whatever that is, I kind of want to uh, go back and do the cleanup of this level. Assuming that it's actually nice enough to give me a, an easier cleanup. Okay, yes, I can go in any door. So I can't even remember if I completed all of these. Okay, yes, I com yeah, I did complete them all. Well, I, I guess that's good enough. I'm just going to, even though I've lost everything, maybe it's a bit more fair even that I, I do actually do it this way. So, this is the one I beat, isn't it? So, let's go into the one by Jabri's Sunset. Yes, I definitely did not beat this one. No, wait. Or did I? Okay, so in that case, I'll be going to Pyro's uh, next. I already feel somewhat confident about this room. Like, I have already learned quite a bit of it. I should probably ditch this guy before the next part. This 
so that guy takes down those and we go up a little higher, trigger this guy. Oh yeah, that guy just bounces off the wall. This, one, this part's actually pretty easy. There, got all of those. Now we just need one easy jump onto there. Oh, you're a fast guy. I forgot about that. Almost messed me up. Whoops, that was dumb. I should have conserved my power up. At least I get another power up. Okay, this is just a survival room. There we go, and he got them all, so we're ready to go on. I think the trick was that I wanted to be on against this left wall here. Because it's the easiest place uh, to deal with those saws. Oh great, I don't even need to bounce up high again, that's helpful. Okay, uh, you guys get out of my way. hit those and there easy peasy that didn't take very long at all I was pretty I was already pretty confident about that room but this one oh this is the left right one so I was already pretty close to the end of this before so let's see if I can uh, remember how to do it and more importantly actually do it whoops keep holding the button and it works out. <laughs> See this room actually isn't too bad because most of it's the sort of thing where uh, you just hold the button and it works. Or at least some of the obstacles are like that. Oh darn it. I'm used to making that jump so when I didn't uh, it messed me up. Oh, darn it. That was dumb. Robos are definitely uncomfortable. Ah, oh, rats. When I had hits, they weren't scary at all. So it's easy to avoid getting hit twice in that room, but uh, avoiding getting hit at all is actually kind of tricky. Got it, just in time. In fact, I got it so fast that I accidentally fell into here. Oh, darn it, that was a waste of time. Got it! Ha! There we go. Alright. We, we made our way to the midpoint, and I definitely... No, wait. This, this one I'm not sure about either. So let's see this one. No, I didn't quite make it to the end of this. I got pretty close, but I didn't make it. So let's see if I can reverse that and uh, get it quickly, since I already know most of the room. Darn it, I was supposed to go there. <laughs> this is a waste of time. Jump over you. Use the sticky stuff to get up here. Both of these gimmicks are really fun, so... There we go. I probably should have launched Yoshi a little bit more slowly, but... Oh, that's the end of that. That actually went pretty well. What was Miracle Waters? Ah, this was the cannon one. I definitely did not beat this one, because the only time I played this room I went flying into the sky. <laughs> Oh, that was lame. At least I can avoid screwing that one up again. So we go right and left, and then we bounce off the saw here. 
and then on the way down I have to time all four of them. Which isn't too bad because they move kind of slow for the most part. Grab myself a fire flower to immediately lose. Yeah, just press the button when it hits the wall and everything's perfect. Throw the more cell block and then immediately shoot. Except, don't do that. Well, let's discard that because I don't know if it's going to disappear before I hit the thing. No! I didn't actually knock the mushroom out of the thing! <laughs> Wow. Yeah, you pretty much just gotta go immediately. Oh, okay. So I also have to avoid the disco here. Nope, that didn't work. Well, that's okay, because I still have my rosary. Oh, this is weird. I've got to curve over and hit it. I have no idea what the timing is on this. <laughs> it wasn't that. Okay, just shoot right away, and like most of the other ones, the timing is perfect. And that one you definitely don't shoot right away. <laughs> I just wanted to try it to see if it would continue the pattern. Whoops. There, perfect. I knew that when it was going down would probably be about the right time because of the timing it had the other time. Oh! <laughs> That's a hilarious trick. Oh, you totally got me with that one. Alright, time to check out the last room by Frozen Quills. I didn't even play this one. Looks like it's Pink Cotton Candy Land with a bunch of saws and other types of saws. Down. I guess it's layers. Yeah, there we go. Oh man, the saws are on layers too, and then I got hit. At least I've got loads of power-ups for this one, and I'll always have loads of power-ups, because I'm abusing save states. Oh wow. Yeah, this is pretty scary. Also, it was funny seeing it just go to, like, normal castle colors for a second. Oh, we don't want to do that. Oh, I could have maybe sponge jump on the saw or something, but yeah, it wasn't going to work at that point. Okay, so sitting near the wall does work there. Let's see if it works here. Yes. So you just want to do that again. Actually, it might be inconsistent. The saws here are definitely different than they were before. Perfect. We just want to keep the platform as far over there as possible. Oh dang, this is this is cruel and unusual. Oh. Was I supposed to bop the mushroom out? Oh no, it's like a pachinko machine. With my power up and a useless free life. Oh I could I can just stand here. Alright, so next time I should just get over here as quickly as possible. The power-up means that there's still going to be some stuff to go, so I can't expect the room to end too soon. Oh hey, there's another mushroom over here. So I guess it doesn't matter if I win the lottery too much. Oh, this time we actually need to move the platform. Whoops. Yeah, that's actually kind of nasty. I've still got my rosary, so there's still at least an okay chance I make it through here. Oh, we probably want to be up here still. Yeah, okay. There we go! Frozen Quills is, has been beaten. 
Now this one, I'm sure I've gotten through all three of them because I did this enough times. Okay, I made it through with Paros, which is good. I've I figure that Lol Yoshi's room is probably much easier with power-ups than it was without them. This one in particular, I think the power-ups help a lot in. Let's try to nab myself a shell for the Rogue too. Just do a low bounce and that's fine. Whoops. Dang it. I wasn't expecting... I was expecting to kill the plant with the shell, but... Yeah, so I need to go under that. Wow, I even kept the shell to, through that too. That one despawned, which is great. <laughs> I'm glad I saved it for that moment, because otherwise I would have died. Dang it. I'm assuming one of these is a power-up. Yeah, I can't get it now, though. <laughs> I have to hit the left one first. So otherwise it scrolls too far. There we go. Oh shoot, they all come at me. I was like, those aren't gonna... I can just sit here until they all go down the hole. Nope. Still got past it though. Ah, and then I screwed that up. <laughs> to save my rosary. No, I landed straight between them. I was hoping that it would just time itself. was safe enough and I got myself a free shell too. Hey, and made it to the end. <laughs> there's a feather over there too. Oh hey, there's a moon, if I cared to get it. Whatever, that's it for this room. I don't care if I technically died there. Now for basically the room that I thought would be the hardest. Part of the reason why I saved it until last is this Yoshi room. For all I know, I was like two seconds away from the door and or something like that, but I think I probably still had a lot more to go. It just didn't feel like I was really that far into it. See, that's hard. You gotta press L twice while also licking the shell with the right timing. It's no joke, that's for sure. Ah, dang it. I guess I just have to jump there. You just want to switch Yoshi. That's all you have to do there. It's not actually that complicated. Which I suspect is going to be the case for a lot of obstacles in this room. But they're definitely hard to read because there's you have so many options at your disposal. Was I supposed to keep that? No, I'm supposed to be ditching Yoshi here, apparently. 
Okay, I was actually pretty close to the end. Well, that's it for that. I'm kind of glad that whatever is after this is separate from this level, because that way I can... I, I can go back and do the cleanup and then do this. So there's no title to this. Is this going to warp me somewhere? Yeah, it looks like it. Back to Yoshi's house. Is it telling me that I beat it and that I need to go back here for some reason? Okay. Alright, so I, maybe there's nothing here and I just... That, that was the end. That was all I needed to do. Have him eat that. Take this P-switch. These red shoes allow you to... Yeah, I, I mean, I've been here before. Yeah, I guess that's it. So... Uh, jump one half. Pretty awesome game. Very high level of polish. One thing I would say is that there are a lot of puzzle levels in this game. Like, I couldn't recommend this to anyone who doesn't really like the puzzle levels because uh, pretty much half the time you're spending in a puzzle. I, I, at least that's what I found. Like, it's not half the levels, but half the time. And I... Uh, it's also not as much fun to edit the puzzles. Like, I enjoy doing the puzzles, but editing the puzzles is a pain in the rear. So I hope I'm not missing anything here. But as far as I'm concerned, I've got everything. So thanks to everyone who made this, and see you later.